There's been arguments forever, actually, about the best jokes. Who tells the best jokes? What's the funniest joke? Are you jokes to Dom? You got good jokes? Oh, yeah, man. I've got jokes that... Can you give me a joke now? No, I can't. Not at all? Because they're all filthy. No, <laughs> you know what I mean? Family viewing. My favourite joke is always what's brown and sticky. Okay. A stick. <laughs> I don't know, would that make that? Yeah, That's my are, they, joke. are they, are they, are they, are they sort of going yeah. like, on? My, my daughters love that joke. Yeah, I bet they do. How and then old you, are they? And then after that you always ask, what's brown and sticky and knocks on my second floor window? And what is the answer to that? That's poo on stilts. Right. <laughs> well, the kids like okay. that. So anyway. would that have made the list no, that we're about to talk no. about now, the best jokes at the Fringe Festival over in uh, Edinburgh? A guy called, a uh, comedian called Masai Graham who goes by the name General Panoche. He's a specialist in doing puns, telling mm. puns, a part of his it's good name, comedy. Good name, Punisher. Punisher. I like that. I like that. Um, has been awarded the, I'm going to call it the best joke in the world, but it's the best joke at the Edinburgh Fringe Festival. Um, I was conversing with a friend of mine who's over there performing at the moment, and she pointed out to me there's 3,300 shows at the festival. So mm. imagine how many jokes there are. Yeah. And there's been a top 15 released, and we thought we might share a few with, of, of them with you uh, right now, if that's okay. Uh, we're not going to lead, read the full 15, and it's always terrible when someone else tells someone else's joke, but you know, bear with us. Uh, the 15th best joke at the moment was got by a guy called Phil Nickel. His joke was, Alton John hates ordering Chinese food. Soya seems to be the hardest word. <laughs> As I said, we're not going to go through all of them. Uh, the ninth was by Michelle Wolf. Hillary Clinton has shown that any woman can be president as long as your husband did it first. <laughs> Annie McGrath was number 10. Don't you hate it when people assume you're rich because you sound posh and you went to a private school and you have loads of money. That's, my, that's a great one. <laughs> you like that, that one? one. Yeah. Um, jump up to number four, shall we? Uh, Mark Smith. Apparently, one in three Britons are conceived in an IKEA bed, which is mad because those places are really well lit. <laughs> it's quite funny. Um, Stuart Mitchell was number two. This is actually my favourite one. I like this one. Why is it old people say there's no place like home yet when you put them in one? <laughs> I, it's, that's my favourite. That's good, I like that. And the number one joke, uh, according to the group that awarded out of 3,300 shows at the Fringe Festival, I feel like Dave Letterman, Brrr, number yes. one joke. Uh, Masai Graham, uh, General Panache, my dad has suggested I register for a donor card. He's a man after my own heart. Oh, well done. You like that? Yeah, Panache, that's great. That's very, like very something good. my dad would say. Do you know what I mean?